hello and uh, as we've just been playing Alien Syndrome for the arcade challenges I thought I'd see uh, what some of the ports look like so we're starting with this one this is on the master system uh, Sega Master System it's a Sega game Alien Syndrome um, I'll try and leave a link down below if I remember to the uh, challenge we've just done the idea is to kill these aliens and save your crew members by going around picking them up and getting them to the exit so let's press start and see what we can do time bomb is set player one round one and Do that. Try and find our friends, and it's a little bit easier, I think, than the arcade version. Oh, and I've died saying that. That appeared out of nowhere, though, didn't that? some alien scums and oh, I didn't want to do that didn't want to walk into him either so I think actually this looks as good as the arcade version maybe there's not so many aliens on the screen oh, let's have another go at it and see if we can get a little bit further and see what the uh, first boss is like try and keep out of the way of these Yeah, it's sort of out of nowhere, don't they? And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Time bomb set, we're not doing very well getting them out, are we? Come on, where's our peeps? Oh, damn him! I think that's game over again, Matt. No, we've still got another, still got another life. Try and find some more of our peeps. Yeah, they just suddenly appear. Those aliens, they're not, not fair. got him just at the same time I got killed. We'll give it one more go on the Master System Alien Syndrome then and see what we can do. One player start, let's go. Yeah I think this does look um the aliens certainly look better than the arcade version. So quick enough let's get down there and see if we can find some peoples down there there must be some more around I think the alien heads are on there. Oh no. 
fired and missed him. Now I think the level seems to be bigger. I don't know if that's just because all the graphics are bigger. Was that a warp? Okay, anyway, that's the Master System version of Alien Syndrome, the first the bit of a first level. Um, yeah, I think it looks. Uh, I think the aliens look better than they do on the arcade. It plays a little bit slower, um, but overall, not too bad. So that's the first one. Uh, see what else we can find. See what other ports we can find of Alien Syndrome. Okay, we're going to try the next version of Alien Syndrome, which is on the ZX Spectrum. And uh, well, let's see what we can find. So we're on there, on there. Press enter to begin game. Okay, so we've got two choices. We'll go with that choice. The bomb is set, rescue the people. Too bad. Oh, we got killed. Yeah, these are more like the aliens from uh, the arcade version. And there's lots of them swarming actually. More than I would have expected to be honest. And I think this this version seems to scroll nicer than the, the Master System version that we just played. Although I'd like the look of the Master System one. This one plays a lot better. Died again. Three thousand points there. What's that for? Oh okay, yeah. And it didn't fire quick enough. So let's have another quick game of that then. Um, I look quite like that, that plays quite well. Um, seems I can only choose one or the other, so <laughs> stay in with a death. Two deaths. Die, you scumbags.
tough old game this one. Not bad at all on this November with an old Specky. So anyway, yeah, that's Alien Syndrome on the ZX Spectrum. And uh, we'll see if we can find one more. Okay, so uh, we played Alien Syndrome on the arcade for the arcade challenge. I'll try to remember to link to. We've played it on the Master System. We've played it on the ZX Spectrum. Now this is the Nintendo NES. So Nintendo Entertainment System. Let's see what we can do. Player, start that on. Mary, why not? Eat, drink, and be merry. Okay, we'll start with that one. Colour palette so much, but oh, we've got our firepower. up the firepower a little bit now. Makes life a little easier. See someone in there? Maybe I didn't. Okay. So I can seemingly go anywhere without waiting for these to open. Don't seem as difficult to uh, avoid as the other, the other games in the series. What we got up here? Fireballs. Yeah. 
Oh, a warp. Okay. Some over here. Oh, we got him, okay. Okay, we can get to the exit if we can. This is the first one of these we've seen with her. Okay, so anyway, that was Alien Syndrome on the Nintendo Entertainment System, the NES. Um, so what did you think was the best one? Uh, it's hard to tell, actually. They've all got some good points and bad points, I think. Uh, the next one I don't like, Color Palette, but it did play really well. Uh, it's a little bit easier, I think, than the Spectrum and Master System ones. The Master System one, I like the Aliens the best. Um, although the NES one was closer to the arcade Aliens. Uh, and the Spectrum one, but I think they all played quite well. Not bad at all. So anyway, let us know what you think down in the comments. Tell us if you like the Spectrum, the NES or the Master System. And um, I'm going to say please like, please subscribe. And finally, oh, don't forget to share as well. If you know people who played these games back in the day and they might like to see these, I'll let them know. Uh, finally, after you subscribe, thanks for watching. Bye.